However, there was this beautiful design and then entered a problem. A problem entered into creation. Humankind twisted this possibility when they decided they should define good and evil for themselves. Now, them? Was it only Adam and Eve? No, history is full of humanity redefining good and evil apart from God. Now, is this just the past? Turn on the news. Open up YouTube. Read the paper, which I still do, just so you know. But you can see it today, amen? Humankind redefining good and evil apart from God. Now, you don't need the news, do you? Do you know people around you who are self-centered? Who choose to live in offense instead of forgiveness? Who practice immorality and believe they know what's right more than God does? Not only apart from God, but they know better. Let's get real. Have you ever had the thought, God, how could you allow this to happen? Or, how could that be wrong, God? It's not hurting anybody. Now, having questions is okay, even encouraged. But judging God based on our feelings is once again defining good and evil apart from God. That's why scripture says all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Humanity needed and needs a savior. God knows in order to restore the unity he had in mind for his most prized creation, it could only be accomplished in one way. His son had to pay the consequence for our rebellion. And here's the good news, church. He did.